following screencast will demonstrate some of the Acknowledge Automated Analysis tools specifically designed for analyzing EEG signals. And here we've got a very short segment of EEG data. You can see where the markers are. The subject had their eyes closed and their eyes open. So in theory, we would anticipate to see an increase in alpha wave activity during this period. To confirm that, if we go to the analysis menu, there's a sub menu in there for EEG. And the first thing I'm going to do is look at the alpha RMS. And the software prompts me for the channel that we want to analyze. I'm going to analyze channel one. And now we've got this new channel down below for alpha RMS. So basically what we've done is run a filter over the data to tease out that alpha wave activity. So I'm going to hide that channel, go back into the analysis, and there's an option here, derive EEG frequency bands. Again, the software is going to prompt us for the channel channel 1. Now the software has run through and it's filtered the data for all the different frequency bands and if I come back into that EEG menu there's an option here preferences. If we look in the preferences these are the frequency bands that we've just uh, filtered for delta, theta, alpha, beta, and gamma. You can adjust these um, ranges to suit your specific data, but these are sort of the typical defaults. So, for example, alpha wave activity is between 8 and 13 hertz. And these are preset, so when we ran that analysis, everything has already been set to this level. And if we come over here, there's alpha on channel 1, beta, theta, delta, and gamma. So there are two quick ways in which you can filter the data and get a slightly different view of the signals you've just recorded. Now, these can be performed online using online calculation channels, but if you don't want to worry about doing the filtering online, it's very easy to come back to the data at the end, pick the channel you're interested in filtering, go to the EEG menu, oops, go to the EEG menu and select either derive EEG frequency bands, or if you're just interested in the alpha wave activity, you can look at the alpha RMS. Okay, that concludes this demonstration of Acknowledge's EEG automated filtering analysis.